Hey friends, welcome to the YouTube channel All About Electronics. So in this question, we have been given this digital circuit, and here we have been asked to find the initial value of this A, B, C, and D in a such a way that even after the clock pulses, this value will not change. So if you see over here, then this is basically a sequential circuit. So here, these two are the D flip flops, and the output of this flip flop is given to some combinational circuit. So let's say this flip flop is the D1, and this flip flop is equal to D2. And let's say their outputs are Q1 and Q2 respectively. So as you can see, the output of these flip flops are connected to these logic gates. And here we have been given that the propagation delay of these logic gates can be neglected. That means here we can assume that the propagation delay of the logic gates is equal to zero. So first of all. Let us find the relationship between these inputs A, B, C, and D in terms of the outputs of the flip flop. So here, if you observe, then this D input is connected to the D1. So we can say that this D1 is equal to D. And further, if you observe, then this D is equal to this B X or C. That means this D1 is equal to B X or C. And the output of this first flip flop. Is given to the D2 as well as the C input, so we can say that this D2 is equal to Q1, and at the same time, the C input is also equal to Q1. Then after, if you observe this A input, then this A is equal to Q2 bar, and if you observe this B input, then this B input is the output of this NOR gate. So here, basically, this NOR gate is used as a NOT gate. That means here this B is equal to A bar, or that is equal to Q2. That means here this C is equal to Q1, and this B is equal to Q2. So we can say that this D is equal to this Q2 X or Q1. That means the input to this first flip flop is equal to Q2 X or Q1. That means here this D1 is equal to Q2 X or Q1, while this D2 is equal to Q1. So now, with the clock pulses, depending on the initial value of this Q2 and Q1, this D1 and D2 inputs will change, and because of that, the value of these inputs A, B, C, D will also change. So for the initial value of the Q2 and Q1, we have total four different possibilities. So let's say the initial value of the Q2 and Q1 is equal to zero. So in that case, this D1 will be equal to zero. And this D2 will also equal to zero. That means these two will be the inputs for this these two flip flops. And because of that, in the next state, this Q1 and Q2 will also remain same, because as you know, for the D flip flop, the output is same as the input. That means in the next state, if you see the value of the Q2 and Q1, then that will also remain zero. Similarly, let us consider the next case. So let's say. The initial value of the Q2 and Q1 is equal to zero and one. So with these values, if you see the value of the D1, then that is equal to the zero x or one, and that is equal to one. And similarly, this D2 will also equal to one. That means initially, if this Q2 and Q1 are zero and one, then in that case, the value of this D1 and D2 both are one. That means after the clock pulse, if we see the value of the Q1 and Q2. Then that will be equal to one. So in this case, if you see, then after the clock pulse, the value of the Q2 and Q1 is changing, and because of that, eventually the value of this A, B, C, D will also change. So now let us take the next case. So now let us assume that the initial value of the Q2 and Q1 is equal to one and zero. So with this value, if we see the value of the D1, then that will be equal to once again one. And the value of the D2 is equal to Q1. That is equal to zero. That means initially, if the value of the Q2 and Q1 is equal to one and zero, then these two inputs D1 and D2 will be equal to one and zero. That means after the first clock pulse, if we see the value of this Q1 and Q0, then that will be equal to one and zero. That means this Q2 will be equal to zero, while the Q1 will be equal to one. So once again, as you can see. If this is the present value of the Q2 and Q1, then at the next clock pulse, the value of the Q2 and Q1 will change, 
And lastly, let us consider the case when the value of the Q2 and Q1 is equal to 1, 1. So in this case, if we see the value of the D1, then that is equal to 1x or 1, that is equal to 0. And the value of the D2 will be equal to 1. That means initially, if this Q2 and Q1 is equal to 1, 1, then with that value, the input to the D1 will be equal to 0, while the input to the D2 will be equal to 1. And with these inputs, at the next clock pulse, the output of this flip-flop will be equal to 0 and 1. That means at the next clock pulse, this Q2 will become 1, while the Q1 will become 0. So once again, as you can see, if the initial value of the Q2 and Q1 is 1, 1, then at the next clock pulse, this output will change. That means out of the four different possibilities, only for the one input combination, the output of this flip-flop will not change. And because of that, eventually, the value of the input ABCD will also not change. So for these two values of the Q2 and Q1, now let us find the value of these inputs A, B, C and D. So we know that here this D input is equal to BXO C or that is equal to this Q2XO Q1. So for these two values of the Q2 and Q1, this D input will be equal to 0. Similarly, this input C is equal to Q1. So initially, if this Q1 is equal to 0, then this C input will also become 0. Likewise, this B input is equal to A bar or that is equal to Q2. That means the value of this B input will also be equal to 0. And lastly, this A input is equal to Q2 bar. So initially, since Q2 is equal to 0, so the value of the A will be equal to 1. That means initially, if we see the value of these inputs A, B, C and D, then that is equal to 1, 0, 0, 0. That means whenever the initial values of these inputs A, B, C, D is equal to 1, 0, 0, 0, then the output of the flip-flop will not change with the clock pulses. Or in a way, the value of the input A, B, C, D will also not change with the clock pulses. So we can say that the value of the inputs A, B, C, D should be equal to 1, 0, 0, 0.